Hi there, I'm Brian Pate from Keller Williams Realty and I want to talk to you today about the working with real estate agents document that your agent is going to ask you to sign when you get together face to face. The working with real estate agents brochure is a required document to be presented by the agent to the prospective client before any detailed conversation begins about the situation that the buyer or seller is facing, any financial information is exchanged, or any information about what a buyer might be looking for. The purpose is for you to understand exactly what the obligations are of the agent and of yourself as you walk through the transaction. Here in North Carolina, we've got a couple of different forms of agency. The first one that you'll probably run into as a seller is seller representation, where the agent represents you and only you throughout the transaction. This happens when agents from other companies show your home. Your agent will always represent you in that case, and so will the company that your agent works for. And that's why we call it seller agency. Everybody that you are contracted with represents the seller and the seller only. The same can occur for a buyer's agent. A buyer will sign an agreement with an individual agent that also works for a company, otherwise known as a firm. When you sign that agreement, the firm and that particular agent are going to represent you and only you throughout the transaction. However, what happens when both of these agents work for the same company? This is where it complicates it, and there are a couple of different ways that this can happen. The most often seen is when the company represents both sides in the transaction, and that is called dual agency. So when the firm represents both sides, they are representing dual principles in the transaction. So we have a contract with the seller and a contract with the buyer, but they're likely with two different actual licensees. So the company's representing both sides. However, there's a law in North Carolina that goes one step beyond this dual agency, and it's called designated agency. And this allows both your seller agent and your buyer's agent to maintain their representation and advocacy just for you in the transaction. So in other words, if we have agent A and agent B involved in the same transaction and they work for the same company, the company would be a dual agent and the individual licensees representing the clients would be designated agents and they would be able to do the same thing that a buyer agent or a seller agent that we talked about earlier can do. They can give you advice on what to offer, uh, give you comparables of what the property is worth, and be your advocate throughout the transaction. Where it gets sticky in North Carolina is when not only the company represents both sides, but the same individual licensee represents both sides. I refer to this as straight dual agency. In other words, the company is a dual agent, and there's another layer of dual agency that is applied by the individual licensee that you would know as your agent. The catch here is that because your agent knows simple things about the seller and the buyer that could cause a negotiating advantage to be given to one party or the other, this agent basically becomes a facilitator in the transaction. They cannot give advice to the listing side or the buying side. They are merely taking care of the transaction. As a result, when this happens, it is possible that you could use, lose some of your advocacy from your agent. And that's oftentimes the most important thing to buyers and sellers. So when you meet face to face with your licensee that's going to assist you in the purchase or sale of your home, make sure to listen closely on the agency discussion and ask them who are you going to represent in this transaction and then they will plan the paperwork accordingly depending on what your needs are. Thanks for listening and for more information please feel free to call me at 919-669-4575 or you can email us at info at paintrealty.com. For a copy of the Working with Real Estate Agents document to review it before you meet with your agent, just contact us. We'd be happy to send you a copy. Thanks and have a great day.